I grew up in a small town in upstate New York called Waterford. I remember taking a drive to my grandparents' house, Nani and Pops, when I was four or five years old. When we got there, my older brother and I seen two brand new Honda three-wheelers. The moment I sat on that machine was the moment that would change me forever. That's the moment I became a rider. But as my story was just beginning, it came to an unfortunate end. Well, maybe not an end, but definitely a change of course and trajectory. My trike was sold when my dad was injured at work. My love for riding was there, but I had nothing to ride. As we got older, I felt something in my soul, a yearning to ride. My older brother started racing dirt bikes. I was right there, in the pits, breaking in new bikes for him and his friends, watching John michel Bale on TV. It was a different time back then. I never got on the motocross track. My brother cased the triple and broke his femur. It seemed like the thing that would never come back into my life was riding. I couldn't let that happen. I began chasing my dream to ride one spring day when my dad gave me his motorcycle. I was 18, and what would be his last bike would be my first. A 1982 Kawasaki AZ750. I rode that bike, and for the first time in my life, I felt that freedom. You know the feeling. Street Rider was born. My story was just beginning. <laughs>